So I was trying to think about this and the best answer I could come up with is that honestly, I'm not sure. I don't know the data for this, but I can postulate that it likely has. You know, COVID-19 further heightened this function in our healthcare system and the fear of contracting the virus likely led to more people postponing their usual health screenings and doctor visits. Um, also, we learned that many essential workers are minorities, you know, the people that are staying out there working in your shops, doing your food deliveries, you know, cleaning up the, the hospital. Um, these essential workers, a lot of them are minorities and with them being on the front line, their risk for contracting the virus was relatively higher. And then you add the other factor that many minorities do not always have the option of working from home. Um, so I think part of the disparity we saw in deaths due to COVID-19 stemmed from our societal structure of who remained on the front line, as well as underlying comorbidities because of access to care in the first place, you know? So when you add cancer to the mix, I can imagine that this does not, you know, doesn't make things any better and in fact worsens the cancer disparities.